guess that's it. Ugh. What a pain in the ass. Well, it's probably gonna be as good as it gets. I mean, not bad. Touch of residual, but not much. Tiny bit there. You got most of that off. It wedges into the pick, you know? That's all off. Cool. All right, I'll let these dry. Okay. And then once they're bone dry, we'll give them a wipe down with alcohol. And uh, make a determination as to what the next idea is. I saw some nice, I was looking for ideas last night on online, just random searches. I was thinking maybe that new gold with some NATO would be a cool look. We could just do a khaki receiver set with a NATO rail. Uh, we have all these different colors to choose from. I don't want it to be crazy wild, I don't think. The gold sounds like a fun way to go, but... Well, I don't know, we could do a gold receiver set. And rail with and do NATO painted furniture or the reverse of that, or I could do gold receiver set, NATO lime or military green rail, and then we still have the uh, the grip around things in the gun room. So I don't know yet. I enjoy the process. It's fun. It's good testing for when you're going to do a, a full gun that you have, you know, just keep it fresh in your head. Alright then, kids. Not sure when I'm going to embark on the new one. We'll let this dry. And then we'll give it a wipe down with alcohol on top of that. I'm pretty sur certain it's degreased at this point, so I don't know. I'll think about it and see what's up. Cool.